Freaky Friday. Today, we're gonna pretend to be a chef. Hop in the kitchen for a Halloween costume. I'm gonna go out trick or treating with the kids. Chef Gobis, as Gavin thinks my real name is Chef Gobis Catering. Um, welcome to Freaky Friday. Halloween treats for you to try it on that we've seen online. What are we gonna do today? We're going, oh, we're gonna do dips. One combo dip, kind of like, remember my first week with the skeleton in the middle of the table? Well, this is gonna be a pumpkin vomiting guacamole and a crazy brains full of queso. We're gonna do a dual dip in a pumpkin so your guests can enjoy it. Okay, all in the prep we're gonna do, it's like a three cheese. I got a pot on here, put that on low, and we're gonna warm up our heavy cream. We're not joking around here, people. We're gonna make real cheese sauce. Real fatty, creamy cheese sauce. So we're gonna get that warm before we add in our, we did a chipotle with roasted tomatoes, scallions, cheese, and our secret ingredient. That's right, cream cheese. And here we have the prep starting. We have a bowl, some avocados, tomatoes, red onion. Um, I chopped up some cilantro, salt and pepper, and lime juice in the bowl. And there is our pumpkin. Now let me tell you my theory on this. So when I saw this pumpkin vomiting guacamole, I loved the concept. And I, um, the picture online was actually of a real pumpkin. Now, I don't know about you people, I don't have time for that. And I thought, I wanna reuse it. Um, but I wanted to be able to do the dual, the top and the bottom uh, with the dips. So what I did was I found a jack-o'-lantern that you could put a candle inside to keep your queso warm on top. And we found um, at the dollar store, just like a little tin to go up on the top. And we're gonna put the guacamole on a black plastic platter. platter. Now I can wash it, take it, reuse it, do it in a different centerpiece. But I don't know about you, but I don't have time to clear out a whole pumpkin and hollow it out and use it one dime. Simmer, so we're going to add our cream cheese first, just using a um, non-stick spat to kind of break it up. And then we're going to add some cheese. Our cheddar cheese, um, just to shred it. You can buy the log and shred it yourself. You can buy the bag and shred it. And now with this being on low, constantly give it a stir to get nice and creamy. And then our third cheese, which is a Monterey Jack. We're going to add that. So three cheeses, and if you want to take a look in the pot, you'll kind of see it start to come together. The cream cheese is my personal secret ingredient. It kind of pulls it all together. So I added everything together, and now I just took a whisk because sometimes the cream cheese gets a little bit clumpy at the ends, the small pieces. So just hit it with a whisk real quick, and the whole point of this is don't stop stirring because it will come together. Oh my God. My secret ingredient is the smoked chipotle and roasted tomatoes. So that's going to get added in with a handful of fresh scallions. I'm going to shut the heat off. Oh, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little bit of black pepper in. Five second case of that. I mean, and when I tell you, you're going to wow your guests. You're going to wow your guests. Avocado, cilantro, lime juice, tomato, red onion. I use little scallions. Put it in the bowl. I'm gonna mix it all together. And then, you know, secrets I tell you, don't throw the pit away because we're gonna put the pit in because then we can save it. Because you don't want to assemble this at home. Unfortunately, it's gonna suck to travel with. So you want to assemble it at your event. So let's get this going. We have our pumpkin, we have our queso. So in here, we're gonna scoop the guacamole. You want to build it up nice and high. So it looks like it's coming out. And then, oh, I need a ladle. Hold on. Shit. I don't have one. Don't have one. Hold on. Please. I love being chubby. Uh, Okay, so, once again, you can travel this in the four container. Here are your brains on top. Keep it going nice and full. Gonna garnish it with some scallions. And then, don't get me yet. You can eat over 
tortilla like we do at work and fry your tortilla chips. You can just buy the rest of the um, I actually like doing the black corn chips because they got kind of look Halloween ish. So you want to put this around your platter. And then you want to eat. Buongiorno! Happy Friday! Today's costume, we're gonna pretend we're a chef. 